Fireworks lit the Albuquerque sky for Independence Day, but much of what you may have seen were not legal and not safe. It was up to the Albuquerque Fire Marshal's Office to hunt down illegal fireworks this weekend. News 13's Kelly Lavoie was right there beside them for the busts. The mission was clear. Track down people setting off illegal fireworks. The first stop of the night trying to catch the vendors selling them. All right, you guys are good. Thank you. 10 to 10, Derek Pino with the Albuquerque Fire Department teamed up with an APD officer, checking to make sure everything for sale is legal. Uh, most times you sort of look around and they'll be in boxes that are behind the counter. You sort of open them up and you'll see them right there. The sunset gave rise to the sights and sounds of fireworks, launching the intense patrol. Uh, those are the sparklers, so those are fine. But other fireworks are not fine. Patrolling, driving down a residential street in the northwest, they're on the lookout. That's when they hear... Okay, there it goes. Ready? Ready? Boom! At this home, one violator is slapped with two citations. One for having illegal fireworks. The second because the officer saw the man set it off. The person cited a firefighter. In another neighborhood, more fireworks. Officers jump out of the car to determine where it came from. They scour the street, pick up empty cartridges, and ask who set the firework off. Which one just went up? Well, you're just standing right down the corner. Oh, I don't right know. Right here in front of my car. Huh? It came right here in front of my car. I have no idea. We got a bunch of legal ones. And these are all ours right here. Oh, yeah, lucky. Some lucky, but several others got citations. All illegal fireworks were confiscated. Kelly Lavoy, KRQE News 13. The fire marshal's office handed out about 40 illegal fireworks citations over the holiday weekend. Violators face up to 90 days in jail and up to a $500 fine.